Hey guys, it's Ashley, and today we're unboxing the August Unicorn Crate. So yes, I know this unboxing is very late, as will be with my Whimsify unboxing, but at least it's getting up now, so let's just get started. As per usual, if you don't already know, Unicorn Crate is a bookish subscription box. You get a book and some bookish goodies every month. It's really great. Some of these things that have come in these boxes have been really unique and things that I haven't seen before, so definitely a plus. I think this month is actually my last month that I'm receiving unicorn crates for like my three month rep period. So it's so sad to say goodbye, but you know what? I've had a blast unboxing all of these. You know, except for this part, because this tape is so annoying. Okay, so I'm not sure what the theme was for this month. Was it? Oh, it was Legendary Archers. <gasps> Special edition crate coming October. 2017 for fans of his dark materials get excited for october the book of dust is a new companion trilogy to philip pullman's golden best-selling global best-selling series his dark materials and for the first installment la belle sauvage will be released on October 19th as a major fan. I have been eagerly awaiting this release. I couldn't resist putting together a special edition unicorn crate that will include La Belle Sauvage, just Book of Dust series number one. I hope I'm reading that right. Plus bookish goodies themed around the Golden Compass and the original trilogy. Okay, well, you know what? If I had read the Golden Compass and that whole series, then I would be excited about this. But for those of you who have read it, definitely something to jump on if you're interested. I love themed boxes. But anyways, the theme for this month's box is Legendary Archers. So exciting. It's such a specific yet vague theme. So I'm really, really excited to see what Naomi's pulled together. We're going to get this little box out first because it was cute. Okay. It says wood nymph, botanical perfume and jewelry inspired by fairy tales, legends, and myth. What is this? Oh my goodness. This is so cute. Okay. I don't know if you'll be able to see this, but look at the packaging. First of all, it came in this little box inside the box is filled with moss. I don't know if this is real moss or fake moss. Cause I know moss can live like without water. I, I, don't, I just, I feel like I know that. I don't know. But, and it's this little silver ring that's an arrow. This is so cute. Now I'm getting moss everywhere. Next, I pulled out a candle from Muggle Library Candles. It is in the scent Sherwood Forest, which isn't that the forest from Robin Hood? Sherwood? I feel like that makes sense. Uh, the scent is pine, cedar, and honeysuckle. Oh my God, if this is a pine scented candle, I swear. Yes, I love, love, love pine scents. Actually, this smells like a mixture of pine, but also like burnt things and men's cologne. That's what it smells like to me, that mixture, but it still smells good. This is what I was looking at and was so confused as to what it was. What is this? What, is this like a pen or something? It's a pen, I thought so. That's so cute. You can attach the little, no, you can't do, can you do that? I don't know. Oh, the arrow, bow and arrow pen with three pen tips, rubber band not included. Oh, so are you supposed to put a rubber band on this and then like shoot the arrow? Where are the other pen tips? I don't know exactly how, oh, oh, got it. Okay, there's one. Oh, maybe, okay. And is that, and there's another one. I got it now. This is the coolest and weirdest thing I've ever seen. Okay, okay, I, I can I can do this. So usually Unicorn Crate always includes at least one unicorn inspired goodie and this month it is these magnetic book marks. Why could I not think of that word? They're super cute and they just have little unicorns on them and I love them to pieces. Honestly, I don't know how you can make a box about archers and not include Legolas. Like, come on. This is so cool. Okay, I don't know if there's a glare or not. I'm gonna try to move it back and forth just in case, but it's a magnet with a black and white image of Legolas from Lord of the Rings on the cover, on the cover, on the front, and I love it. I love it a lot. Okay, so this is a print called the Artemis print, which if you know anything about Greek mythology, that's Artemis, goddess of the hunt. And this was made by Little Paper Forest, I believe it said. And it's just a little five by seven print, but it's so adorable and perfect for an archery box. All right, and then I pulled out a notebook, actually. It says, may the odds be ever in your favor. And there's a silhouette of Katniss on the front from the Hunger Games. And it's just a little lined notebook. And that is so seriously cute. It was made by 
Chiara Leone. And finally, we're getting down to the book of the box, which is as always packaged so beautifully. So the book of the box is called No Good Deed by Kara Connolly. So it's about this girl named Ellie who's about to qualify for the US Olympic archery team. And so she goes to England to qualify in the trials and she gets stuck under the caverns of Nottingham Castle and ends up in medieval England. So I'm getting very, very outlander vibes from this because I think doesn't Claire like do something and then she ends up back in time in Scotland. I don't know, but that's what I'm getting from it. Uh, she just wants to go home, but people are suffering and she realizes that she can make like Robin Hood and help save some lives. And things are probably gonna go very wrong because time travel never ends up well. And this sounds really, really interesting. And as usual included with the book, we get a signed book plate from the author and a letter from the author. I cannot speak today. And so that is everything in the August Unicorn crates. I really, really enjoyed this. Some of these things are very unique, as I said earlier. And thank you so, so much to Naomi from Unicorn Crate for sending me the first three boxes that she's ever put out. Actually, the first four boxes. I think I did May too. I really, really enjoyed unboxing these for you guys and just, oh, it was such a great experience and I highly recommend Unicorn Crates. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I still do have a 10% off code. I think it still works for at least the September box because this was the August box, so the next one would be September. So that is going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so, so much for watching and thanks once again to Unicorn Crates and I will catch you later. Goodbye!